The Biden administration hits pause on natural gas exports. Who are the winners and losers? Hello, this is Chart GPT today. Yes, recently uh, the Biden administration uh, announced pauses on exports of LNG natural gas to new exports, not necessarily existing. So that's kind of a curious move. A lot of people are scratching their heads on that. I'm going to take a dive into it and take a look at it and what all this means. This gets into a lot of geopolitics. As we know, since the Ukraine war, there's been a lot of sanctions on Russia. So you can see the EU has shifted their imports away from Russia to uh, the U.S. And you can see the rise there in 2022 and 2023. And so they've been trying to import more and more. And so you can see the U.S. And Qatar, the, the Russian component is, is sunk dramatically there. So that's an interesting point. Looking at the uh, forecast, you saw the supply shock in uh, 2022 with the gas, yes, but the, the, there's been gradual rebalancing. You know, the BRICS, the Global South, the West, and now there's kind of return to growth. It's had a spike in prices. Let's take a look at the prices here. Here's the, uh, the prices in the EU. A little bit above trend. There's a big spike in 2022, but, you know, they've kind of stabilized down here. Uh, a little bit higher we see the comparison to the u.s market and it's and the u.s market is hitting new lows so maybe this is an attempt to to do uh some rebalancing in pricing when they say uh when something happens always look follow the money they always tell you what what's going to happen take a look at the shipping rates here they've been elevated because of the red sea situation and some of the disruptions in uh, uh the shipping so there that's another issue so take a look at the potential reasons the Biden administration may have done this particular move. Is it a brilliantly orchestrated scheme? Step one, U.S. prohibits Europe from buying Putin gas from Russia because of Ukraine, of course. Step two, replace it with increased U.S. LNG at a higher price. <laughs> the U.S. then, under the guise of saving the climate, pauses new LNG exports to keep the prices high. So that's one strategy that could be at play here. Or put pressure on Texas and other red states because a lot of that LNG is coming out of red states ahead of the election. We wouldn't accuse anybody of doing politicking in terms of using the economy to help a uh, political party or not, or both. A win-win for Biden. He basically puts the screws to the EU and the red states for his political gain. What do you think? Take our online poll. What's the real reason for the Biden LNG export ban? Is it really for climate change or is there money behind it? Take a look at what the AI says. In terms of the importance of liquefied natural gas markets, follow the post link in the description box below for that. Now don't forget to subscribe.